Making decorative garden art balls is a good beginner project, but there are a few things to know before you get started. I'm Melissa from EmpressOfDirt.net. First, choose a base that can withstand the weather. Options include anything made from nice thick glass like vases, fish bowls, or lamp globes. Bowling balls are also a popular option. Avoid things like styrofoam that can disintegrate or sports balls that may deflate. The surface of your ball needs to be clean, grease-free, and not too slick. If you are having a hard time degreasing it, try something like this methyl hydrate to get it really clean. Bowling balls may need sanding so the surface is not too slick. Also, don't worry about the finger holes, just place them at the bottom of your design where they will be hidden. If you want the background of your design to have a specific color, now is the time to paint it with a spray-on primer paint. Be sure to avoid gloss finishes, and you may want to lightly sand the painted surface with sandpaper before continuing. For adhesive, I always use GE2 silicone sealant. It's sold as a sealant but works great as a waterproof outdoor glue. Be sure you choose the type that is waterproof, intended for outdoor use, and dries clear, not white, or some other color. And always check the tube for the use by date to be sure it's fresh. The designs on garden art balls are made with flat bottom marbles that you can find at dollar stores. If you don't see the colors you want, also check online, there are lots of options available. The quantity needed will depend on the size of the ball, your design, and the size of the marbles. They vary a lot in range from small, about three quarters of an inch in diameter, to very large, about two inches in diameter. So read carefully before you buy so you know what you're getting. If you want to fill the gaps between the marbles, there are many options. Any fine, durable materials can work, including vase fillers and fine gravel sold for aquariums. Choose whatever has the texture and colors you like. For this project, I am just showing flat bottom marbles. Plan your design before you start. I set mine out on a table like you see here. Be sure you have enough of everything so you don't get stuck. You may find it easier to support the ball while you're working. Here I'm using a restaurant cup holder. You could also use a towel or a bowl. It's necessary to work in small sections because the adhesive is only sticky for about 10 to 20 minutes and then it is set. Once it's set, you cannot remove it or attach anything on top of it. Apply dabs of adhesive to the back of each marble, about 1 8 of an inch thick, and press it onto the ball. If gravity does not keep it in place, hold it for 10 to 20 seconds until it stays. Continue until your design is complete. Check your product label for drying time. Some silicone sealant is rain ready in 3 hours and fully cured in 24 hours. And those are some top tips for getting started with making garden art balls. If you would like more information, see the article at the link below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again next time.